Hi, I'm Tom Mullaney, that's me. I'm here today to answer the question, how does one create a Google Jamboard Jam? So I am on my Chromebook, but this will work on any laptop with the or desktop with the full on Chrome browser. The first and best way is to create it in Google Drive. And I would suggest going to the actual folder. So I'll go click on a folder right now. And to organize your Jam, a Google Jamboard Jam is a Google Drive file. Click New. Then click more and you may have some connected apps, but you sure enough, you will see Google Jamboard and there you create it right away and it's organized in the folder that you want. And there's my untitled jam and it is now in that folder. How great is that? Another way to do it would be to go to Drive or Gmail or Google Classroom and find the apps launcher, AKA the waffle. And I have my Jamboard up real high because you can click and drag these. So I put it real high because I use Jamboard a lot, but you may have to scroll down further to find it and then click that there. And you'll see why that came up in a second. And that brings me to jamboard.google.com and that there I can create, press the new jam button and that will send me into a new jam. One other way, there is jamboard.google.com. So if you type that URL into the Chrome browser, you will be brought to your Google Jamboard homepage. You'll see the jams you've been working on and you can click that button to create a new jam. One more way, this is for Chromebooks, for Play Store enabled Chromebooks, go down to your shelf and I have mine pinned to my shelf, but install the Android app for Jamboard. It's more robust, has a lot more capabilities and features that is really the best tool to use for Jamboard. You can use this app. Really, you could use it on your phone, but really best on touchscreen, Play Store enabled Chromebooks and on iPads, as you can see. And there's my there's my Jamboard app. Took a minute to load. One other caveat. Let me go back to Google Jamboard in the web. One other caveat is if you're working on your work or school Gmail account, your administrator may not have enabled Google Jamboard. They should because it is a G Suite for Education core service, absolutely wonderful for students and for teachers. Um, I'm doing this all in my personal account. So if you want to see how this works, do it and try your personal account if your school or work account is not working. If you have any questions about that, please comment below or tweet me at Tom E. Mullaney. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.